Hey guys, now you can see over here that uh, this is the frame I'm going to build for the downside. The same thing will come over here like this. You can see this welding. I have to do this weld over here, this weld, and also this will come like this. Same, same like this over here. So I have to weld this wall, and the next process will be to add one more steel over here and to weld this like this over here. So the front assembly is going to fit this front slim assembly this is the tire and the motor will be over here and the battery also everything will be over here and this i'll cut over here to make it long so that i could cash now you can see this is a smaller size i need to increase this height of this but anyways now this thing will fit over here to make it turn and the weld this thing will be welded over here like this you can see this complete frame will be on this side from center of this area i'll be back once i weld this all thing together i'll show you the final progress now yo guys you can see completed this thing is also completed and the frame downside frame it's ready you can see it's a good two step like this and two steps over here and the steering we can catch over here plenty of space for the leg room it's plenty of space over here you can see good now I have to will this Well, this over here to assemble the motor because this is the frame where the motor assembles. Now I have to do welding over here and assemble this back at its place so that I could use the motor over here. So, guys, let's see. Yo, guys, you can see it's done now. This thing. It is oof, very hot, <laughs> very hot. Just now I finished the welding over here, it's done. Now the main thing is to assemble the motor and everything. Now I can fix this back over here. So I'll get about uh, this much of ground clearance, you can see. That will be a lot more than my expectation. It's good. This frame is assembled now. I need to cut over here and make it big. That I'll do once I assemble the rear tire also. When the rear tire is assembled, that time I'll do this cut and make it high to check what is the height I want to make. So let's just assemble this together guys you can see over here this uh, is the final fitting i have done until now the motor you can see i've fixed now it's time to attach the chain with this tie over here wheel over here and uh, the motor is done so there's place for the battery as well you can see over there's enough place for the battery I'll keep the battery over here and the wiring so all the everything will be this will be the steering and the button will be installed over here and this is the frame downside frame I'll put a plywood over on the top over here there will be plywood on the top and I need to do this finishing over here this I have to make it plain so that uh, there will no issues with the plywood and the rear tile is still missing uh, I have to figure out the way to keep the tire over here and I'm I don't have the tire with me right now so I will do it once I get this this tire so I have to make a frame the tire will be over here this side behind this so other than that everything is done so I need to 
and it's very late now so i'll continue the progress of this uh, after and this was finishing i have to close this uh, over here i'll just uh, put something over here the plastic or something like this to keep close this mm, other than that everything is done you can see everything is good